Hey guys, good morning. It is my second day using this GoPro Hero 10 camera. I used it for a very first time yesterday, just walking around uh, to the Union Square. And I had my camera, I think, in my opinion, uh, the in the lowest setting. It was under the basic mode, recording in 1080p, 30 frames wide. So uh, I think that's the most basic. And the battery lasted for about an hour and a half. So I'm like, okay, uh, from 100% to down to 3% in about an hour and, and, a, and a half, or, or I think even less. So I told myself, well, you know what? I'm gonna go ahead and not record in basic anymore. I'm gonna go ahead and record in standard now under 1080p, 30 frames per second under the wide lens. So that's what I'm currently recording with now, is, is that setting. Uh, I don't know what standard is, yeah, I, that, that, that's the thing. I'm so excited that I didn't even do, do any kind of research about what the, what the differences between standard and, uh, and basic. So if you guys know, please educate me. I'm one of those guys that just don't want to deal with instructions and stuff like that. So anyway, um, I'm going to try to record uh, a party that's going to be going on today at work. It's my manager's retirement party. So I'm going to do some time lapse. I'm probably just going to do some quick, uh, some quick uh, footage here and there. People talking about him. Uh, but we'll see. We'll see. Hopefully they allow it, right? Anyway, um, I'll see you guys there. Oh, wait, wait. By the way, by the way. I just want to ask uh, for the GoPro Hero 10 and whatever uh, professionals out there. Uh, so when I turn off the camera, is there something in the background that is that's that keeps going, that keeps working? That's why the battery drains so fast while the camera is off. Please let me know because uh, I can't find anything on the internet unless I'm just not typing in the correct words or something like that. So please let me know. All right, $33. Not bad, not bad. That's why I try to uh, fill up my gas tank while it's on half. So it'll be like around $30 or so. All right. check out Embarcadero really quick. So here's Embarcadero for you guys, just a small part of it. Now as I'm extracting some footage earlier, there was one out of uh, eight videos that didn't uh, extract correctly it was a corrupted I don't know what the hell happened to it I put in a new SD card it's from uh, PNY so I'm using a PNY 128 gig gigabyte SD card right now and I don't know if it's working properly or not but so far I had one corrupt video while downloading to my phone so I don't know if it's if it's that or there's something wrong with the GoPro. But I never had that problem be before when I was using my SanDisk. So if it happens again, I'm gonna go ahead and switch back to my SanDisk, but that one's only, that's only 64 gigabytes. And this one, this PNY is 128 gigabytes. So I'm using it right, right now. But if it gives me another corrupt video, I'm gonna stop using it.
like them in a movie scene. You know, in one of those sad romantic movies. Quick tour of Embarcadero, so I gotta get over to work now because I gotta help with the uh, with the setting up with my manager's retirement. Well guys, that's pretty much it. It was such a lovely morning today. I'm glad that I got to take that walk over at Embarcadero. Yeah, so I was supposed to go ahead and uh, record my manager's retirement party. The time lapse is, is all that I, I can do. But I got um, stuck doing other things for the party. So um, yeah, so that's pretty much it. Uh, thanks for watching again and hope to see you soon. Peace.